think both of these, the little short coat girl is definitely going to be big enough. But the little long coat girl at six weeks old, she's only predicting to weigh three and a half. But, you know, there's a chance that that could change and she could be more like four and a half. Also, there's a chance she could be like three. Um, so I'm holding on to her, hoping that she's going to be what I need, which is four pounds or more. Right, baby? Your name is Cupcake. And your name is Cookie over here. Yeah, you're a cookie. Um, so the reason I'm doing the video of these guys, even though I'm keeping them, is because in case I don't keep little Cupcake. If so, if you're looking for a long coat, black and tan and white female that's going to be tiny, that's a little bit older, check with me in a couple months and um, we'll find out what's going on with her. Yeah, feels like coming outside to play. Huh? I know. It's fun out here. A lot more fun than in the house because in the house you're just so used to it. Yeah, it's like you're way too used to it in the house. People always wonder why you take them outside for the videos. Like there's something wrong inside. No, there's nothing wrong inside. Um, everything's fine when customers come over and they see everything. I bring them outside because of the light. And also because it gets them used to traffic, it gets them used to being outside. It's just, it's good. Yeah, and we got the nice Florida sunshine to really show you guys, show your colors. Yeah. You want little babies? Mm. Your mama is retiring. Yes, she's retiring. She's gonna go to this beautiful home that I got for her. Yeah. And, and people wonder, how can you retire your adults? Because this is a business. Can't, I can't have 75 dogs here that are geriatrics. I just, you know, that's not fair to them. It's not fair to me. It's not a way to run a business properly. I spay them. I get their teeth cleaned for like the third time. And I um, find them great homes. I um, like to retire them early at age six. That way they have an opportunity to live their second half of their life being totally spoiled. Well, more than their second half of their life because they lived to like 15, 16. Yeah, so they, they're only with me for a short time. And then they get to go and be spoiled. I do a pretty good job of spoiling them too, but it's just not that one-on-one -on -one because I have quite a few. So they get everything they need. And they get great food, great treats. I cook for them. Um, but nothing like being a little lap dog all the time getting to go bye-bye with somebody all the time. Alright, long enough video.